Welcome back. We've got to make a confession. We have fallen in love with this little guy, Cash, and his parents, Will and Jennifer Lee. As we first told you here on California Live, they went through hell when little Cash started having strokes just after his third birthday. To make matters worse, he was misdiagnosed. Thankfully, Will and Jennifer kept pushing and discovered little Cash was actually suffering from a rare disease called Moya Moya. After two intricate surgeries to reroute the blood flow in Cash's brain, he's alive and thriving and one of the cutest little boys you will ever meet. His story touched so many people. It was nominated for an Emmy. Hi guys, it's so good to see you again. How are you doing? Hi. How are you? Good to see you. So good to see you. Cash, how are you doing? Mm, doing good. You're doing good? Where are you? I'm in Canada and I had to be in quarantine for 14 days. I'm losing my mind, but today we're officially out of quarantine. Congratulations. <laughs> Wait, Cash, how old are you? I'm seven years old. You're seven years old and you're losing your mind? <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. uh, well, Cash, we're about to change this for you. I'm about to do something exciting for you. Are you ready for that? Yeah. You are ready? Okay, so the last time we talked, we were talking about the Emmys and because of everything that was going on, we couldn't be at the ceremony. We couldn't be on the red carpet. You asked if you could walk the red carpet. Did you miss that? Yeah. Did you really want to do that? Yeah. You did? Okay, so what if I tell you we have a surprise for you? We love you guys so much, and okay. we just think that your story is incredible, and you guys sharing it with the world, and how it made such an impact that we were nominated, all of us together, for an Emmy because of that story. Um, yeah. Before we go further, what did that mean to you guys? Well, I'll let you speak first. I mean, <laughs> you know, I mean, the, the joke was, you know, I've been doing this for 20 years and, you know, <laughs> my son is part of an Emmy campaign before his dad. <laughs> Um, but, you know, I mean, in all seriousness, I mean, we, we've always were hesitant to tell his story. And, and I think when he kind of understood some of the things he went through and, and we asked him if he wanted to tell a story to help other kids, he said he wanted to. And so just that it touched this many people and um, yeah. was able to be on your platform, I think it will encourage other parents to keep fighting, even when they might get a first diagnosis of something. And and kids are so strong. I mean, him being able to do this is a miracle. <laughs> so um, we are very. <laughs> oh, and I, all well, the things. We're not trying to encourage I'll... that, gosh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, all right. we're just so grateful. Yeah. Well, so from the magic of Zoom and how we do TV right now, here comes your surprise. So I want to oh. introduce you to PETA, and she has a very, very big announcement for you. So I'm going to bring her in. There's oh, Peta. Hi. Hey, Peta. Hi. How are you? Oh, I'm, I'm going to let you. I'm going to let you do it because you've got better news than I will ever have. <laughs> oh, wow. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thanks for having me. So, Jennifer, Will, Cash, um, we love the segment. It moved us. Uh, having it be nominated for a daytime Emmy was just icing on the cake, but we thought we right. might put a cherry on top and oh give you a stay at the Conrad Punta de Mita. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it is the newest. <laughs> yeah, it's right there um, in the Riviera Nayarit. And when I tell you it's brand new, the ribbon cutting is taking place as we speak. Oh my gosh. Oh, what? wow. Yeah. <laughs> you said it's a Cash, we're going to Mexico. <laughs> we're going to Mexico. <laughs> oh my God, thank you. Thank you. You are so welcome. Thank you. Wow. You are welcome. We need a beach right now. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So you've got two miles of beach to, to wow. stroll and play. And Cash, they have three swimming pools. Three. What? Yes. No, what? It's going to be so fun. And wow. it, you know you can do whale oh, watching. That is so amazing. Oh, whale watching. If it's so season's cool. right, you can whale watch. Wow. Mountain bike. Are you zip telling me? 
I can't wait to see your pictures when you go. Oh my gosh, we will definitely be sending pictures. That is so thank you guys. beyond this generous. Amazing. Yeah, this is awesome. Peter, thank you so much. Will, oh. Jennifer, Cash, you know we love you. you. Thank, thank you Enjoy. so much. You are so welcome. You are welcome. so welcome. Um, and just thank you guys so much. And as much as we appreciate all of this and can't believe that he was nominated for an Emmy and this <laughs> insane vacation that you just gifted us, um, I think I just want to make sure that everybody who has seen Kesha's story knows that the reason we spoke out is because we really wanted to, um, you know, advocate for parents who advocate for their children because you know, it's just so important that they can't speak up for themselves and don't necessarily, you know, if you have something in your gut telling you that the diagnosis is wrong, to please just press forward and um, don't give up on them. And, you know, you're going to have days where everything just, you're so exhausted that you just want to believe what you've been told. But if you know in your heart and in your gut that it's not right to just please press forward for your children because it's so worth it. Yes, it is. <laughs> Aww.